Okay, good morning everyone. Uh, it's the third week in July. Uh, we just had a bunch of, or I guess it's actually raining. And so I figured I'd do a, uh, a weekend update really quick. Oh, uh, got some tomatoes going on. This is that tomato plant. It's got a ton of tomatoes, doing really well. Uh, got some random lettuce and, and everything coming up in this bed. I threw a bunch of seeds down. Here's another tomato plant that's growing really well. This is an heirloom tomato. Um, right underneath it, I've been putting a ton of coffee grounds, putting mulch on top of that. These are pumpkin seeds that I just had thrown on there that are growing up now. Um, but basically, what I've been doing this past week is throwing a bunch of coffee grounds everywhere and kind of digging them into the top layer of the soil. Uh, you see all that, all that black stuff is all coffee grounds. So I'll just mix it in and, and hopefully it'll help compost um, just kind of on top of everything. Here's that um, Triple Crown Blackberry. I got all these apple trees coming up in these pots. And here's all the apple trees in those containers. It looks like slugs eating some of them, which is annoying. But uh, they're all doing pretty good. I'll probably plant more seeds in the spots that haven't popped up anything yet. Um, this is the coffee grounds that I've been getting, the, the new Starbucks ones. They kind of switched over in certain areas. Uh, that's really good, fine material. But tomatoes are doing good. I guess these cherry tomatoes just haven't grown very tall, but they still have a bunch of tomatoes on them. Uh, this pumpkin's doing pretty good. I got the pumpkin right there. And so this bed just right here probably has a few hundred pounds of coffee grounds mix mixed in with the wood chips. This is kind of what it looks like and then I'll just dig it in really quick. Uh, just to try and build the soil as much as possible. Um, over here, this elderberry, and this elderberry's been kind of a pain. It'll wilt kind of towards the end of the day, maybe it's thinking that it doesn't get enough water or something, but it's just kind of struggling, I don't know if it's going to do very well. Uh, but I wanted to show the worm bin back here here's what's left of the worm bin and I had a bunch of uh, the cake I had put in there and everything and it just reeked but I'm just going to put a bunch of coffee grounds in here and uh, get those going. So, lesson learned, worms don't really like to eat cake, but if you see, there's still a ton of worms in there. Uh, here's some of that cake, <laughs> you see that, and it just made it stink so bad. Um, so I'll just fill up this whole thing with coffee grounds, see what happens. There's a ton of worms in here. Um, I got rid of one of the worm bins, because it's kind of more than I need. And I covered this one with coffee grounds because it was just smelling too. So after you do that, it smells a lot better. And then, right now... The misting system's going. I'll try and see if anything's rooted down there. Um, 
getting a ton of strawberries this past week, two weeks. Um, I'll probably get, you know, a bowl full every week. Some are big, some are small, but they're doing pretty good. Um, I mean, just here, every one of those spots was a strawberry. So just imagine how many strawberries were just on this one plant. And so this whole row back here has strawberries, or is a strawberry plant. And even though this doesn't get a whole lot of sun, uh, they're doing really well. So I guess they don't need a whole lot. This, I mean, this area probably gets maybe three hours or so of sunlight. Because if you look, that's the back half of the yard are huge trees. Um, and this apple tree is growing. Probably grew, you know, you can kind of see where it's darker compared to light. That's the new growth. So, I might graft onto this one to this year. Uh, or over the winter. Uh, but that's kind of what's going on uh, this weekend. Um, all the updates... Um, here's the hardwood blueberry cuttings. I'll s might need to, I might bring some of them up, see if there's any roots growing on them, and I'll pot them up. Uh, but I'll do a few more videos.